hope you're all having a great day if not it's okay um do not worry things are going to get better and you are going to be good so don't worry about the things that has happened or you're fearing of other things in your future please stay calm the universe is there to guide you spirit guides and angels are there to guide you and my channel is all about guiding you in a spiritual way so if you would like to subscribe please subscribe and also guys so i do give general readings for your energies and also for your person's energies take the energies as it resonates it can be like vice versa that your energies can be for your person your person's energies can be for you so just uh, take the message as it resonates for your situation okay because this is just a general reading i cannot give any specific details but i will make sure that the reading helps you in a way that you can um use it in an everyday scenario right guys so without any further delay let us just start off with your reading so i'll just start off with the moon phase today we have the moon in aquarius the waning gibbous moon in aquarius so how is the moon going to affect you as we all know the moon phases does affect us emotionally physically psychologically and also spiritually so we will find out some information about how this moon affects us i can see here that you might be feeling a little bit betrayed today or you were betrayed uh betrayed relationships can get a little bit um uh, confusions may arise in a relationship or there can be a, some kind of a complication that can arise in a relationship which will make the, you think that um this connection is very complicated or it might make the other person think that <clears throat> your relationship is very complicated right and also i see here that with the waning gibbous moon that uh, today when you are in a group of people is easier to understand the feelings and kind of like free from uh, be free from the negative emotions that you're having see you always want to maybe like stay with people in a gathering or you want to spend some time even though you're a person who never goes out today's a day you will definitely go out definitely talk to others kind of mingle with the people around you to kind of uh, like tone down that negative feeling that you're having and that is also another beautiful energy because today you might have a lot of negative emotions such as fear anger jealousy hatred embarrassment betrayal or i'm getting a lot of negative energy so instead of uh, thinking about it in a, a lonely way you're going to take it into a different a level in the sense you're going to ask about ask um, about the emotions to the people around you that is really going to bring some clarity into your situation right so that is the energy i can now get out of these cards and i really hope uh you're liking it i really hope that it resonates with you guys and another message i'm getting out of the cards is that today will be a day when you might be getting unwanted emotions in a sense you don't even have a reason to be emotional there can be unwanted emotions or from your person try to kind of avoid those unwanted emotions okay and um, also for a few of you i see here that you want some kind of like an freedom you want to explore your emotions at the same time you want your emotions to be kind of like not taking over the complete entire day so in a sense you love to have freedom with your emotions you want to express your emotions you want to talk about your emotions but at the same time you don't want to spend the entire day just dealing with your emotions you know what i mean so that is the energy for you guys today for your general energies for the day this is how you will be so let us take cards for your love energies now what is coming up for your love energies cancers 
for your person's past, present and future. What are they thinking? What were they thinking? What are they feeling right now? And what are they going to do about it? Let us find out. Cancers. The feeling, the past, the present and the future. So for this person's uh, past and your past, like you past together, with the Queen of Wands, I definitely see that they were mostly concerned about how passionate you are, how amazing. They kind of like looked at you as someone who is very admirable. They see you as someone who is very, very beautiful. They admire you for your qualities. And also with the Fox, I can see here that this person sees you as someone who is like who they cannot trust definitely they feel like they shouldn't trust you that is a definite energy but again they feel like the beauty in you is just drawing the attention that is how they kind of felt infatuated with you okay i can see here cancers they had a crush on you The person that you're thinking right now has a secret crush on you guys. Cancers, oh my god, isn't that great? Right, so that is the energies uh, for your person's past and your past and how they thought about you the, for the present energy. For the present energy, it might seem like it's a long road for them to come towards you. So this person might feel like, oh my God, to get this person to love me or to come towards this person to make them, uh, to make them mine. It's just such a big process. So they feel really like i don't know what to say guys it's not like they feel like it's just too much to come towards you it's like they've went through a lot in their life and they don't want to start all over again with you they just definitely feel like um, a little bit burdened but also i can see that they are spying on you they're spying on you but you definitely don't know that this person is spying, but they're definitely spying on you from a far away distance. They're seeing you, they're asking about you to your friends. This person is going uh, around talking about you, they're asking about you, but definitely you don't know about that. So what is coming uh, for your future energies? What is going to be the energy with you and this person in the future? <clears throat> so we have the Six of Pentacles. This card is all about um, showering your dreams working on your dreams working on the things that you want in life so this person is doing the opposite so they do want you but i don't see this person coming to get you even in the future they're not going to come and get you so soon so i'm really sorry um if you are uh, kind of like sad after uh, me saying this but i have to be honest with you cancers this person is not going to come soon to you okay they're going to they're not going to give in uh the time and attention or they're not going to give the necessary things a person should give to make a relationship progress in a certain way no this person is not going to give you that time and attention and everything okay so i'm really sorry if you guys feel a certain way okay so yes um <clears throat> and i hope this um <clears throat> situation really uh, ties through for you guys so uh, so keep watching if this person is going to come i will be honest i'll tell you that they're going to come so every day i will be picking out the past present and future energies for your person and you so you can um subscribe and hit the bell icon so that you will be notified whenever i upload a reading and you can watch me okay so that you get a clear insight of what's going on with this person's energies so thank you so much my beautiful cancers